Hey guys! Hey! Guess what? My Chemical Romance. Do you know who they are? I love My Chemical Romance, but I haven't heard any of their new stuff. This is a brand new brand song. New. Like, I think it literally came out a couple days ago. Somebody just told me on one of my um, feeds, you have to hear a new MCR, which is My Chemical Romance. That's how versed I am in those guys. Wow, you're using the acronyms? Or exactly. Impressive. MCR. And this one is called, it just came out, The Foundations of Decay. Tell me, that is an awesome name. Very title. The Foundations of Decay. I mean, come on. I'm looking forward to the lyrics. <laughs> I know, exactly. Okay. Well, let's listen to see what it sounds like. I'm in. Oh, this is going to be fun, man. I haven't done one of these guys in a long time. Ready? Go! Ooh. Oh, sounds like the K. I have to read. We have to look up the lyrics right now. I, I, yes, this, I gotta hear it. And I'm glad there's not a lot going on in the video yet. Yes. Because I keep wanting to close my eyes. Yes, right. Like this music makes me just want to. Oh. I just want to get into it. I know. I I I close my eyes a lot on songs because I want to hear it. But isn't that interesting? It reminds me of back in the day when we used to put headphones on, so you could cancel out everything. And turn off the lights and listen to your favorite music. Yeah, just completely get lost in it. Okay, lyrics, dude. Didn't you love the sound of the decay? Sounds like you know what I'm saying. Like they look like uh, termites or something. Well, They're termites eating something. Oh, I thought That's I thought it was like like an ocean of bodies or something. Well, 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 kind of. I mean, they're an ocean of uh, termites. That's okay, gross, or... let's see the. Uh, my Chemical Romance, The Foundation of Decay Lyrics. Here we go. I'm going to read it. Oh, come on. Yeah, it's a little hard to make out the lyrics. There we go. See the man who stands upon the hill. He dreams of all the battles won. But fate had left its scars upon his face with all the damage they had done. And so tired with age, he turns the page let the flesh submit itself to gravity. Let our bodies lay while our hearts will stay. Let our blood invade if I die in pain. Now, if your convictions were a passing phase, may your ashes feed the river in the morning rays. And as the vermin crawls, we lay in the foundations of decay. <laughs> he was there the day the towers fell. And so he wandered down the road, and we would all build towers of our own, only to watch the roots corrode. But it's much too late. You're in the race, so we'll press and press till you can't take it anymore. Let our bodies lay while our hearts will save. Let our blood invade if we die in pain. And if by his own hand his spirit flies, Take his body as a relic to be canonized now, and so you can get, so he gets to die a saint, but she will always be the whore. <laughs> well, that's wild. You know, that's some solid poetry. That is stand alone away from music lyrics. Totally. Yeah. 
It, like, it's totally if I read poetry. That in a book of poetry, I would read it like ten times in a row. Oh, totally. You look stressed out against faith, against all life, against change. We are free. What do you want? You must fix your heart, and you must build an altar where it rests. When the storm decays and the sky it rains, let it flood, let it flood, let it wash away. And as you stumble through your last crusade, will you welcome your extinction in the morning rays? And as the swarming calls, we lay in the foundations. Yes, it comforts me more, much more. Yes, it comforts me much more to lay in the foundations of decay. Get up, coward. Wow, it's pretty cool, man. Okay, let's just see if this video actually does something other than just decay. But can it, I close my eyes? Absolutely, you can, man. You ready? <laughs> Go. So I, did, I saw that this is their first new music in eight years. Yes! So, and they like broke up before that and then... Yes! So how does, how do people who haven't worked together in eight years create this? Dude, the, I am so proud of these guys. They have come so far in their musical talent. I, I don't want to say it. They've matured 
way more than what I remember. Yeah. I mean, they were good back then, but they're young. And, you know, the, the singer, he's like a, a genius guy. He writes good lyrics and he does good music. But when you're younger, it seems like once they broke up, he must have went out and did other things and produced and did things. I don't know what he did. But sure. all I know is all this it. is this is a hit, dude. Okay. This is a huge this song hit. Yeah, it is amazing. Honestly, if this was a brand new group, yeah, right, no history, this would be incredible. Oh, exactly. But it's almost like I almost wonder how how it's just going to be a hit because it's almost like it's like a B side, you know, like you know how like yes. back in the day you'd buy a a single 45 and the the one they played on the radio would be the a side right, yep, yep. and then you flip over you're like oh what's this song and it ends up even better right yes i i i don't i don't know what this is about yet somebody just said hey mcr came out with a new single this is a single how do you get together and write something so incredible without going we gotta do this is so good we gotta Maybe do more you music get some good comments from MCR fans, you know, that yes. really followed and know these guys, you know. Right. I know their music from, you know, however many years now, but uh, I don't know anything about. Right. Well, what have they been doing? Where are they, you know, what, you know, and so everybody's going to tell us. They're going to be like, well, this guy was, he did this and he did that, and, you know, and they came back together. I don't even know if it's all the original band members. I can tell it's the same singer guy. Well, also, I'm curious if they're performing live. Because if they were doing any touring and they introduced this song, like on stage, it Dude, would be the best song of the whole night. This is insane. This, and even though the video is somebody was like, hey, you guys just, you guys just made a single. So uh, we're just going to stick it out there. And um, it's called The Foundations of Decay. So we're just going to put a, a camera on some termites and just yeah, have a whole have video. Really that. A video. Yeah, we I'm glad. Exactly. Because I feel like if there was too much going on, it would be taken away from the attention. Exactly. Of I'm focusing. I'm watching the screen because I have to because it's a gigantic screen and I see the sure stuff. Do. But I'd be listening to the actual music, what the the, act, the meat of it. You know what I'm saying? It's incredible. Well, I don't usually pay to download music, but I, I have to. Oh, totally. <laughs> exactly. All right, you ready to finish this up? Oh, my goodness. No, I don't so, want to finish. I want to keep on going. Well, okay, time. we're going to do a 24 hour yeah. reaction. <laughs> we're just going to keep looping it for 24 hours. See we'll, what we look we'll take like. turns sleeping. Yeah, in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? Go! I love it. Oh my goodness. You know, it it plays like a live performance. Oh my goodness. I mean, I'm actually questioning, is that studio work? Or oh, was it it has to be studio stage? work. It sounded so perfect in there. I don't know. But yeah, you know, that was a long song. It was like, you know, five minutes or something. And uh, I don't want it to be over. Dude. 
Plus, it did seem like three songs at once, you know? Oh, yeah. Like, like you think, oh, yeah, that song It changed great. up tempo. And then there's like a bridge, yep, yep, and then it's yep. like, yeah. Dude, I'm so proud of these guys. I am so proud of these guys for this. I'm impressed. Yeah, they, they are, well, I'm an old guy. I was listening to them like they were an emo-type band, and I still love them, but I just feel like this is so much more mature than what they had. Oh, it's just so good. So good. Because we all mature in our yeah, age, so you know, and we get better. They probably look better. And that's what it should be. And you Absolutely. can't say that forever. Some, some, some groups, songwriters, performers, recording artists, they're around for a long time. And then they, you know, they come out with something new. I don't know. Maybe they're broke or something. <laughs> yeah, right. And yeah. it's kind of like, eh, all right. You know, we love them. But, we're, but yeah, stuff like this. Or to say, like, after all There's, those years yes. of hiatus between recordings that they could, you know, Maybe, you know, this is debatable, but mm -hmm. could this be like their best work ever? Yeah. Oh, this is clearly their best work. There is making music just going, okay, let's just put a record together. Then there's inspiration. This is inspiration, right? I mean, he didn't just come out with this and go, ah, oh, let's just put the single together so we can, uh, you know, maybe we can get the band back together type thing. No, they were, he, something inspired this guy to go let's get the band together i got this song and it's going to be a killer hit i'm inspired again but you know like you said you know i'm an old guy and i probably have never even heard of my chemical romance if i didn't have teenagers you know yeah right you know at, at one time and and then but you know it's wonderful that a different generation can introduce us to something that we can love so much yes and you know i mean not that my Kimball romance is a new band or whatever right. you know but even when they first came on the scene we were already getting old so. oh of course yeah i never heard of them until last year Woo, guys i don't even know how to stop all i know is i can say i love my chemical romance agreed so until the next one i hope they come out with some more peace